Hey everyone, Paolo here. So welcome back to just another dang how-to channel. So on this video, I'm going to show you how to install Cocoa Pods using Gem and using Homebrew. So Cocoa Pods is a third-party dependency manager for libraries uh, that you want to import to your Xcode project. So instead of manually downloading it and doing all the linking, um, you could use uh, Cocoa Pods to do that for you. So if you visit the website on the getting started, which I'll add to the uh, description below, uh, the installation requires that you use Gem, but you could also use Homebrew, which I'm going to show you later. So if you open up the terminal, uh, first thing you want to do is make sure you have the latest Gem um, version. So you go, you say sudo gem update dash dash system. So I'm on the latest version, so I'm good to go. So to install Cocoa Pods, you say sudo gem install Cocoa Pods. So immediately from the guides, uh, it just says to do that, but I hit an error about file permission because I don't have uh, right access to this directory. To get around this error, um, you need to pass a parameter user local bin. And if I now go to pod version, dash dash version, you would see that I have uh, Cocoa Pods installed. So that's how to get around this error. And to complete the setup, you just go to pod and type uh, setup. So this should download all the pod specs on your computer. So you could do a pod search, let's say Firebase. And it's going to tell you the pod spec and the version and other more details here. So it's cool. So let me uninstall um, Cocoa Pods on Gem and try to install it using Homebrew. So to uninstall, simply run this command sudo gem. Instead of install, you say uninstall Cocoa Pods. It's going to ask you to remove these two executables. You just say yes. And then CocoaPod should be uninstalled. So the other version, uh, other way to install CocoaPods is using Homebrew. Uh, if you haven't used Homebrew before, it's uh, also a dependency manager. And it's easy to use. So you just uh, copy this command on your terminal and it, it should install it for you. So I don't need to do that because I already have homebrew on my machine. So if I go to brew list, I have several applications that I already installed using homebrew. So if I want to install Cocoa Pods, um, let me just make sure that pod version is not working. So it says command cannot be found. So if I go brew install Cocoa Pods, what homebrew is doing it's first checking homebrew is updated and then try to install the uh, latest cocoa pods that is on the homebrew repository cool so it got installed if i go pod and check the version you would see that the version that got installed is one version lower or 1.9.1 instead of one point 9.2 but it should still work the same if you want the latest features then you should go use um, um, Ruby gem to install or L or you could use uh, homebrew so you just do the same thing you go to pod setup and then you should be good to go so that's how install how to install Cocoa pods on your computer I uh, hope you like this tip 
Um, if you want more of these, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye for now.